Deckham Bad video. So yeah, we got a whole bunch of new news in here. We got a Deckham Fest tier list. I didn't make a short, I've been making short the last few days. I'm just gearing up for the videos and stuff like that, of course, because I, oh no, I've been fine. It's just that, um, been just super, super tired, just trying to rest up and relax, so. But we got a whole bunch of just new news in here for tier list. It's awesome. It's beautiful. Got to probably roll through it really fast because we have so much stuff to talk about for tier list. Holy crap, though. Okay, we got a Doka Fist season yesterday. Made a shirt on that. That should be up by now. That should be way up by now. Um, we got just hold, uh, the title and everything. We just get just do it. I'm going to definitely make shorts for, shorts for these two because I do want to kind of react over it on my own a little bit, though. So I'm making a full dedicated video, and I'd rather just do that than, um, you know, um, like, you know, going back and forth making this video and that video, making it being outdated. It just shorts are a lot more faster for me, and just this is beautiful, honestly. Really, really beautiful, and I, and I love it. I am half tired, though, so it's used to voice. I did just wake up pretty much just to all this, so thank you to, of course, the Duncan Official, War Duncan World. Um, I was saying Miska, Missa, Miss, I can't even try to pronounce I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, Miska, or Miska, Miska, uh, Doken, um, oh, well, I can't believe it, Doken Kai, I was like Doken Kai. Uh, and of course, of course, all the translations and everything, of course, you guys are awesome, of course, all the info translations, images that we have, we have a whole bunch of new stuff, of course. We have Turles' squad members, they're getting their own, like, little side banner units, we got two side banner units, pretty much, they're getting the Ginyu Force treatment, I love that already, so it's really good. I think it's like Ava and Raisin. I think it's like Dawes and um, Coco or Coro, Coro, Coro. Um, but yeah, I think they're all based off. Sorry, they're all based off fruits, pretty much. And Toros is pretty much it's for, again for the trader might I was like, holy crap! I was just thinking about this as I was doing the video, getting the video ready. I was like, wait, I was saying their names. I'm like, wait a second. Trader the fruit of might, and because of all different fruits, I like that. I like that. It's just, it's the Saiyan and Frieza thing. Like you know, all Frieza's fruits are different to coolers. Or cold, gold items, or anything. And same as the name of the vegetable. Joe's car looks clean though, though. I love that. I cannot wait for that SSR though. But yeah, that's gonna be. Whew, man, that's gonna be the thumbnail clean right there though. Um, but yeah, though. Oh, we got the info and everything, of course. And of course, we got some new site stuff right here too. So yeah, we have Dawson Coco. Coco? I think Dawson Coco. I'm just gonna pronounce it as that though. But I got a, we have a new, brand new Dragon Ball story event though. We have Dr. Wheeler getting his own event though, which is insane. Uh, we have um, Gohan and Icarus. Um, pretty much Icarus coming down. Kid Gohan, which is his grade eight form. Uh, SCR Charles is getting his awakening, so he's getting an SR from a SR from a normal regular SR from SSR awakening to a full on SSR awakening to a full on TR awakening. We'll probably get an EZA and probably part two though. And of course, Doctor Wheel is getting his own event though. I think it's a prime battle event though. The translation looks like it's gonna be a prime battle event though. Katrina was saying that it was gonna be a prime battle event, and of course, this me yeah, yeah, LO Dr. Willow, he is coming to Doken, so yeah, we are getting LO Dr. Willow, we're getting more movie stuff a hero again. I feel like he fit more as a Doken Fest though, but honestly, him as LO, he is worth it though. Again, go on, go on, Krillin, and um, again, go on, Krillin, and Rush right now is a big thing coming up though, because again, that kid Goku, he does what he, he is going to awaken into a uh. LR because he doesn't have Goku family. In the LR Goku and Raleigh, when they awakened, they had the same leader skill. They're not on Goku family. Goku was on Goku family. For um, SSR, LR, or Raleigh, Goku and Raleigh, they had the same leader skill, plus two key to their category or whatever. And no Goku family. So yeah, Goku, it's going to awaken to an LR. It's, it's pretty much confirmed. It's going to take some time though. So again, I feel like they were. But like yeah, we're gonna just leave that to be again. It's gonna wake in at a different time, so not right now, but it's gonna definitely wake in at a different time. Maybe before another Dragon Ball story event, because that's what they did with Goku and Raleigh. They made they separate them all into three two different events. And made it to like they made them his own event where you can wake them all separately. Cause you go wake in like you have Goku as his, um S R to S S R D U R. They have a T U R and the next event is L R the last event though. But yeah, we're always getting a full on prime battle. That's insane. That, I woke up to that. I was like, what the world is this? But yeah, I'm gonna make a strong that reacting over that too. But yeah, of course, Charles is right here getting his awakening too. That's another good, that's another layout I can make too. His card art, oh my gosh, so clean. Oh, I love the Charles' card art, so clean. Ah. I, know, I love Charles. I don't know, I just like to I love Charles. He's cool. And of course, we got the support member, which is Kid Icarus and Gohan, which I'm gonna love that. 
a little good tender moment. And of course, I'm joking about story event though. All right, now let's go over all the translations for all these guys. Uh, let's do, actually let's go over the side units this time. Let's, let's let's change it up a little bit. Let's go over almond. I'll say almond and raisin. Yeah, balls that guy's got a new car. Let's go. We could. Oh, actually, yeah, because he has two. Because there's two two balls that guy, so they can just get a car together. A lot. So of course they do planetary destruction key three all set to one thirty. The super attack effect raises defense up for one turn. Supreme damage high chances um high chance to seal super attacks. Oh yeah, super attacks, not super attack. That's, that's something a little bit, bit to point out. Attack defense up one fifty at the start of turn. Planetary destruction category allies get key one. Attack defense up thirty percent. If there's an ally who's belonged to who's belonged to space travel like four years category, they receive an additional defense plus twenty percent up to max of ten percent for each performing crit. Perform a crit. Oh, but triple perform a crit. Guard activating gets all attacks and reduces the team by twenty percent at the first attack around the turn. Get additional attack plus fifty percent and performs additional super attack with two as a second or third attack around the turn. Gets an additional attack defense of thirty percent each time guard activated up to max of one fifty. Okay, that's insane. Holy crap! They are just they are just the game force on crack right now. Links are loyalty, destroyer of the universe, team turtles, which is pretty much all the turtles guys. But it'll beat down, Death for Conquest. Okay, that's a good look right there. Death as Nails and Fierce Battle. Dang, yeah, they have like, yeah. like, they're all gonna be sharing the same ones with Trilla, so they're all gonna be good together on one team, which is good. Like I said, if you're gonna make side units like that, just go all out. Like, they are disgusting right here. Basically, like, in the future, with just, like, planetary destruction, like, this could be a planetary destruction ish celebration right here. Um. Space Traveling Warriors, categories of Space Traveling Warriors, Joint Forces, Terrifying Conquest, Planetary Destruction. They are insane. Boy, that's that's good. Of course, on to now to Dawes. I want to say Dawes? Dawes D- D- and um, I want to say Coco. The not Saiyan, of course, whatever I thought it was. Well, yeah, because it has the same, like, the same, like, armor on. And, I mean, so do they, though, but, I mean, hey, it could be, I mean, yeah, she has spikes on it, like a little race cor- correlation there. I also like it. They are space traveling warriors key three. <laughs> yeah, a lot of space traveling warriors and planetary destruction buffs. It'd be cool if they were just like the same unit, like these two were like the same unit. Just you know, he's planetary destruction, they're space traveling warriors. I don't know. Space traveling warriors category key three, all sets up one thirty. Super attack effect raises attack up for one turn, speed damage, high sense stun. The passive key two attack defense of one fifty at the start of a turn performs additional attack that's high chance of becoming a super attack. Gains an additional attack for ten percent for each attack for each crit perform ten percent ten perform a crit. Um and if it enemies attacking um, for each space or traveling where a category ally attacking in the same turn in the same turn other than this character, gains additional attack defense of one fifty and may have chance to perform a crit and may have chance to evade enemies attacks as a second or third attack on a turn gains additional attack defense of thirty percent for every free super attack performed up to a max of one fifty. Okay, they're all they're pretty much the same unit. Let me go here, let me do this. Yeah, they pretty much all just the same unit. He's just buffing like, Patriot like, Warriors. Yeah, they're just a buff, category buffer. And they just do crit and dodge. I honestly like them better, though, honestly, though. Because this is the buff for these categories can help out a lot more. This is good, too, though. This is going to be really, really good, too, though. Because going for additional. I mean, they're just, yeah, like I said, it just. Again, they pretty much have to have a special like, warrior category out of it's attacking the turn. So, again, like I said, it's going to be just the whole thing. They have the same links, though. They just have. They, uh, yeah, they're literally the same links, same categories. Not gonna waste time on doing all that. They just have solid support and they have tough as nails. Not gonna waste too much time on that though. I mean, they're, I, I feel like they're okay. I mean, they're good though, but these guys are probably because these guys are just more of a category helper buffer. I mean, these guys are good too though, but hmm. I mean, you have potential though. I feel like they're just a lot more better because category buffs, but. They were good too, though. I don't know. I feel like I could see them perform a little bit better than these guys. And there's all support at the end of the day. But I could probably see them doing some good damage, though, with the crits and invasions. But like I said, I feel like these guys could be a little bit more better. Again, yeah, they were pretty much the same unit. I mean, they are the same unit, though. It's just I feel like these guys are a little bit more better. I mean, but hey, three girls came choosers. Okay, on to the boy. The big boy, Turles, and Great Ape Kid Gohan in the background. I thought it was going to be Great Ape Turles again. I was like, wait, what? What if? Delgar Fest? Hey, yo. Just kidding. Where's his leader skill? Holy boy. We got a paragraph in here. Oh, boy. Uh, uh, leader skill, special epic warriors, or pure sand ski three, all sets of 170. Well, that's good. Plus additional, all sets of 30% for characters of planetary destruction. And local, or low cost warrior. Ooh, quadruple leader skill. Okay. Okay. That's good. Um, 
That, that's a, yeah, that's a really good little score. I have like plenty of instruction instead of patrolling. Well, no, it, it doesn't matter. It, it really doesn't matter. The super attack, he has intro animation. Okay, that's good. Uh, super attack effect raises his attack and causes him his damage work over 6% HP. Hmm, full additional, maybe. Give them more HP buff. Um, passive. Okay, let me see. Oh lord, he has a paragraph. <laughs> activates his intro animation. As the start of a character's second turn. Only once if there's a Goku family category enemy or enemy who has Kid Go on. Okay, that's easy though. That's half of the game. That's really like half of the game. Goku, like Goku's and Gohan's. That won't be that bad. Unless you Goku event, you're gonna destroy this guy. Uh, so that's your face. And all the extreme class allies get key three to detect. Oh yeah, him and the him and the LR ones could be. I feel like LR turtles might be getting an easy A. That's the big thing right now. I think everybody's theorizing. He be like, they're good being insane together. <laughs> Holy crap! And towards the TOR too. You can you can pretty much make a whole turtle team. And the end one potentially getting CZA, and of course the spirit on Goku and Great A turtles. You know, getting their easy A's. It's so much easier potentials. <sighs> <laughs> Don't mind me, I just woke up. And all stream class allies gains. I'll reread re -re this again. All stream class allies get key three attack, attack plus 18 percent for the rest of the battle. Holy crap! <laughs> um, attack plus attack to 1 16th start of a turn. Gains additional attack up 60 percent. Performs additional attack that has a high chance to become a super attack. Range for 50 percent or higher. I guess like to balance it out though, because he does so much already. It makes sense. Gains additional attack plus 100% when performing a super attack. Gains key 2 and 5% damage reduction. Yeah, key, no, key plus 2, 5% damage reduction and 4% defense. Yeah, he's gonna be tanking and doing a lot of damage. The attack performed. I mean, oh, each super attack performed. So, yeah, definitely go for additional for him. Max above, um, up to max of 8 key damage reduction up by 20% and defense up 160. Effective against all types and performs additional attack that had to. High chance of becoming a super attack starting from the turn when your character performs a six attack in battle. So yeah, Turtles gonna be doing a lot of damage. He's gonna be defending any attempt reduction. But yeah, you had to kind of limit him with the super attack thing though, because up fifty high fifty percent or higher, which makes sense because he does so much already. Yeah, they're all just super attacks, but like just get a super attack with these guys, and they're gonna be just fine. Like go for addition for all these guys, because they're gonna be critting and just. Buffing each other up all over the place. And yeah, Turtles teams could be insane though. I'm glad they didn't, they did not introduce them to a category. Like a Team Turtles category though, but man. Boy, he's insane. The active skill. Um, conditions able to use after three turns. Have elapsed from the start of battle. If there's an enemy belonging to the Goku family or... Which makes sense. Or an enemy that says, um, includes Kid Gohan. Or once six turns that fell past from the start of battle only once. That isn't that bad though, but you're not gonna see that though. After six turns, you might. Oh no, you can. We have more difficult events nowadays. But yeah, I mean that's easy to go family and go on. Like that's really easy though. <laughs> it's the moon. <laughs> the moon. I gotta do that. It's the moon. The moon's cooking this time. We're pissing on the moon, you idiot. <laughs> Just kidding. Like so, same warrior race, big bub bosses, third for conquest, brutal beatdown, prepare for battle, destroy of the universe, a fierce prime battle, fierce battle. Categories are Bishop Wing Warriors, Spear Saints, Predator Destruction, Holocaust Warrior, Movie Bosses, Turf Conquerors, Final Trump Card. Okay. Yeah, Turtles is disgusting, though. I mean, holy crap. Like, the thing he, the thing he can do, no one else can really do, because he gives them, he gives everybody key, which is going to be freaking insane. He, um, well, it's a battle matter of fact. He's going to be getting his defensive stats up. He's going to be super attacking through the moon. And he's going to be doing higher, he's going to be performing more super attacks. And he be getting more super attacks. Just because the percent chance he's gonna be had damage reduction and yet, which doesn't, eh. And he heals like Charles just does everything. If he crit, he would do everything in the game and dodge. But I feel like they did kind of want to include that though, but they added them to these guys, which aren't that bad. I feel like these guys are really good though. These guys are good too though, but I feel like these guys could perform a little bit more. But they're all gonna feel the same anyway though, so it doesn't matter. But what Charles can do, holy crap, is like. What he can do is insane. That's crazy to think about that, though. <laughs> yeah, but I could just go ahead and debate it here, though. But think about Turtles, though. He's really insane, though. He's he's good. What he can do, I don't know if he can do, but he can probably make it better. But with this, all the support, like in like LR Turtles, TR Turtles, it, it Turtles could get an easy A, the EGO grade A1. 
AGL Doku Fest, the easy A1. Turtles team really is going to be cooking though, like he could probably be one of the best support teams in the game, like just one of those crit additional attack or damage reduction alone, he could probably be one of the best teams in the game. I'm saying this now, he can, he's insane, but yeah, see you guys later though, thanks for watching, have a great day, great life, I'll continue again now, so stay safe, watch your hands, comments, all of you going out, put on mats, I'm talking about really take your best, if you can, go outside, just forget to be a drop off from the Discord, so it's perfect, you guys are awesome, we got to come out with this info though, of course, you like to hate it, my voice cut out there for a second, but yeah, like, Turtle is like, he is, he's good. He might be actually one of my favorite Duck Fest, like for villains, like, cause I like, I like all the villain units in the game now, but he might be actually one of my favorites, like top five at least. Like he, he can cook, like with this team, he's probably gonna be one of the best in the game. Again, LR Turles could get an easy A, TR Turles, LR Turles, AGO Turles, these three. Yeah, one of the best crazy support, support teams in the game. I feel like he could rival Ginyu. Maybe probably not as much though, but I think Ginyu, uh, he's gonna, this is gonna be on, like Ginyu part two. Yeah, see how they're looking though. Peace out. Uh -huh.